Okay, now we show you how to uh, adjust the tire readers. Here you can see, here is a thinning volume. Thinning volume, we can adjust by, by ourselves according to different bottles. There's a thinning volume, and then here we can use a 22 or 5 something, and like this. And this one is a capping torque. Capping torque, it means a cap strong and, a, and a strong or, or light. And this one is capping speed, and this one is capping time. So we can adjust uh, these parameters here. This is no problem. And then the most important is uh, this uh, here. You can see this is a uh, piston. Piston push speed and the piston stack back speed. Piston is mean thinning here. Piston stack back speed and the piston push speed. Push speed also it means the thinning speed. Stack back speed it means uh, the stack back the material from the tank to the storage piston inside. This is uh, this function. This this two function just for this difference uh, uh, with custom products, and then we adjust these parameters. And this one is uh, capping go up speed. It means here, here when the spotters go up when fading, here is go up up speed, and down speed is here. This is uh, while fading and the bottles is down speed. It means. Uh, while thinning and bottles down the speed and also can adjust it. Usually we were some should this or just this two parameters, just this one. This uh, capping down this uh, thinning down speed and uh, this uh, thinning speed. This two speed must match well and so that make sure this uh, low this thinning no dipping. This is most important for this uh, push this uh, piston push speed is also the thinning speed and the suck back Suck back. Uh, uh, this is a uh, fading down down speed. Sorry, fading down speed. These two parameters is most important when we adjust this uh, different products fading volume. Okay.